Welcome everybody, Mike Martinez, and today I have the pleasure of sharing the, the platform here, this uh, webinar with uh, my good friend and colleague, partner at, uh, in, in the state of Illinois, Ms. Lisa Holmes. And today we're gonna be talking about something that's crucially important for those people that are looking for something to do or maybe uh, are, are caught in this unemployment uh, fiasco that we have across the United States. We're looking for people to train and, and help become public adjusters. Uh, Lisa, thank you again for, for joining me. Thanks, Mike, I appreciate being here. Yeah, well, Lisa, let me ask you this because um, you were kind of in the industry, uh, uh, you know, where you were working with catastrophic losses, families that had gone through catastrophic losses. Mm -hmm. What uh, attracted you about uh, the public adjuster career? Well, I, that's basically how I found out that public adjusters are even uh, a career. I, I was working with adjusters from every major insurance company over the last five years, and I was beyond frustrated at how poorly so many of my clients, which are the insurance companies insured, how poorly they were treated in terms of not having phone calls returned, about not being given the appropriate information, uh, about not knowing what the answers are. Some of these adjusters are in classroom for two weeks and then they're out in the field and they can't tell their clients anything. They can't inform them. They can't make them feel better. They keep saying, well, I have to go talk to my manager. So I got really tired of people being uh, mistreated by companies that they had theoretically been paying thousands of dollars to over the years. And so when I found out that public adjusting was an actual career, uh, I jumped on it and studied and got my license so I could help people basically uh, shepherd them through the process and kind of protect them during the whole process of getting their claims settled. You know, that's a great point that you bring out. Um, and, and here's what I want to point out to everybody. You know, uh, this is really, really, really a, an industry where number one, it's recession proof, right? Because we, we, don't, we don't buy or we don't sell anything. Um, our, our business is helping people when they experience damage. We help them uh, prepare the reports, prepare the paperwork, prepare their narrative so they, they can present their claim to the insurance company and we can get them the highest possible settlement based on their policy. We make sure that clients are being paid fair. Now, Lisa, was in an industry where she was working with people that had catastrophic losses. She was helping relocate them, but she saw some of the abuses that go on in the industry. And so she mm -hmm. said, hey, you know what? I wanna be on the right side of the table and I wanna help right. people. So if you are a person that, that uh, you know, again, looking for a second career, maybe looking for a part-time career, maybe looking for a career change, you know, total career change, and you like helping people, right? This is one of the, this is something that you may want to uh, take a look at, right? Uh, it, but in your estimation, um, how was the training? Because you came in, again, uh, as a catastrophic uh, uh, counselor or, or uh, assistant for other people. How did you mm -hmm. find the training that you got from our company? Well, it was, it was, um, it was great. And I, would pick up the phone, I would send an email and I would have a response and an answer to my question. Of course, there were uh, webinar trainings uh, that now the, the training that we have is, gosh, three, four, five, six times a week sometimes, depending on what the topic is. Of course, we've escalated the number of uh, Zoom meetings and online meetings than trainings that we do because of what's going on in, in the world right now. But I am just thrilled at how quickly the company has responded and just dialing up the, the the quality of everything. It was great before, it's even better now, and the response time was amazing. And one of the trainers that they have, his name is, is Bill. I've never known how a human being could make this information entertaining and enjoyable, but he's really, really good at that. Bill is unbelievable, yeah. And uh, he's at the very top of, uh, he's, he's the head of our adjusting team. And uh, he's an incredible guy. He, he really knows his stuff. And, and I'll tell you, I, 
uh, he, he must eat and sleep this stuff because he, he knows the, in, the business inside out. Um, as far as getting your license, how did you find that? Well, I, uh, I uh, studied for a long, long time. I'm not a great student, never have been. I failed my real estate license twice before I uh, was able to pass, but I, I never give up what I, what I lack in uh, what I lack in my ability to learn quickly, I make up for in my tenacity. And if you want it, uh, it's available to you. I had to study and uh, study hard, but I was able to pass this test the first time around. I was very happy. Yeah, don't let her fool you. She's a wonder woman. She's a wonder woman. She really does uh, some incredible things. And she's like an analytical thinker. She wants to get the very last detail and, and she captivates things. So that's a, that's a beautiful thing. Now, is this for everybody? Well, that's a great question. It sure isn't. Um, you know, we're, we are looking to expand uh, Illinois, certainly, and we're looking to expand in, in New Jersey and Pennsylvania and, and everywhere, actually. But no, this isn't for everybody. Uh, you, first of all, you have to have compassion. That's really important. Mm. And, and you have to want to help people because that's what we do more than anything. What is a side uh, a sidebar of this that I had no idea when I endeavored to get my license was how lucrative the opportunity is. Uh, I had no idea that it was uh, it could be as lucrative as it appears to be at this time. Now, I'm, I'm new and getting started. Uh, but I've talked to people that have been doing this and, and some of them are earning, you know, a hundred thousand dollars a year working 20, 40 hours a month. That's a month. Now, are you going to start out doing that? Of course not. There's, there's a lot to learn. There's a lot to wrap your brain around, but, uh, the, the support that you get is great. The feedback that you get is great. It's a very professional organization. Uh, with compassionate people that really want you to do well. So it's not for everybody. Just because you have a pulse doesn't mean it's the right thing for you. You know, you've got to want to help people and why not make a great income doing that? And uh, it could replace a full-time job. It could be a part-time job. That's the beauty of it. Now, one of, one of our adjusters takes his kids to school every day, picks them up every day, He's still able to work his his business full time, and and what a blessing that is is to be able to mm. still be involved with your family and all of their needs, and still be able to help people. Yeah, you know, when I first started, like I said, I was an EMT, um, and I, I I started because my daughter had an issue, and and uh, you know, I I looked into it. She gave me a little pamphlet. Oh, look, Dad, they're hiring. So I, I went into the uh, office that I'm, I'm, I'm running now in, in uh, Cherry Hill, New Jersey. But I went there and I, I saw the presentation and it, it just made sense to me. But I was a, a full-time EMT and I kind of transitioned. I went into it part-time. And my very first claim as a, as a claims rep, once I had passed my training and all that, my very first claim paid me $475 for one hour's work. And I, my mind was just blown away, right? <laughs> Never made that type of money. I was an EMT, right? Uh, and, and I was sitting there. I remember sitting in, 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 because there's two people in, a, in an ambulance, sometimes three. But uh, in this particular case, there was two. And I'm sitting there with, with, with the guy saying, man, I'm sitting here wasting time. I, I, you know, I made 407, right? I was just like, my mind was blown. <laughs> Um, you know, Einstein said that a mind that's stretched to a new, new size is never comfortable in its original position, right? And that's what happened to me. Once I, once I got a taste of, hey, I can make three, four, five hundred dollars an hour doing this, it just blew my mind. Now, of course, you know, it, 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 just to be totally transparent, we don't work 40 hours a week. And so you don't, you don't multiply that $400 by 40 hours. That's just not reality, right? Uh, but the fact of the matter is, like Lisa said, we have people. My mentor in the company is, is a guy that's working 20 hours a month, right? 20 hours a month and is a six-figure income earner. So that's the potential. Now, again, like she said, is it something you're going to do right from the beginning? No. It's not something you're going to do. You're going to have to learn. You're going to have to commit. You're going to have to pick up new skills. But 
It is possible. That's the key. That's what I want you to take with you. It is possible. So if you are looking at this and you are one of the millions of people that say, you know what? I'm, I'm ready to, for a, a career change. I'm ready for a side business. I'm ready to do something to, to, to uh, you know, I've been retired for two years and I'm tired of sitting at home watching TV. I want to do something, right? We got a lot of people that are retired, military, law enforcement, retirees that are just running with this, right? Mm -hmm. And a lot of people come in on a part-time basis and yet are, are, you know, they slowly transition into a full-time. Some people come in right from the get-go as full-time. Uh, but whichever way that you want to do it, if you see an opportunity here, if we sparked an interest, pick up the phone, give us a call. You can speak to Lisa. You can speak to myself. You could say, hey, I saw your video. Uh, I need some more information. I'm looking for something else to do. We are here to mentor you through the process. We are here to help guide you to develop a career where you could make a, a good deal of money helping other people. And that's what it's all about, really. If you have a heart to go out to help other people, then then this just might be the right ticket for you. Anything you want to say before we close here? Yeah, I think it's important to mention that even before you get your license and you're still in training, there are income opportunities that you can you can be earning money. It's not uh, you have to get your license first before you start earning. So, um, you know, we can share that information with you. And uh, so as you're transitioning, perhaps from a full time job or a part time job. You, you know, you're not you're not having to wait to get that license before you can start earning money. They, they've got a number of ways where you can start earning right away within 30 days. Yep. That is the key guys. So again, if you, if we sparked an interest in your mind, all you need to do is pick up the call, uh, pick up the phone. I went and I sat in my, in the office that, that I'm working from right now. And I saw an, an orientation. I took an interview there. Lisa, on the other hand, uh, uh, went and contacted me and I sent her a video and she saw the video, called me up with some questions she had and then said, I'm in. And then started diligently practicing for her test. Called me back when she passed her test and said, Mike, I just passed my test. I'm ready to roll. Right. And right. she's been, she's buried herself into the company training. That's one of the strong points the company has. Excellent, excellent, excellent training. We take you from zero experience to professional level. So if we sparked an interest, pick up the phone, give us a call, let us know that you're ready to get started and we'll show you what the next step is. And you're always in control. You always say, hey, I wanna continue or no, this is not for me. If it's not for you, no big deal. We, you know, we, we part as friends. Maybe you'll have a claim for us in the future, but you owe it to yourself to take a look. If you're a person that, that likes helping people, this is, this is a great, great, great industry where you can help people. Um, Lisa, thank you very, very much. Anything else you want to say before we go? Uh, Mike, it just, just that, uh, you know, take the time to, to talk to one of us about the opportunity and about public adjusting. And uh, if you, you don't think it's for you, then it's not for you. And we part as friends. We're not going to continue to try to contact you and change your mind. Uh, you know, some will, some won't. So what? we move on. And, and, and uh, if you're curious, we're happy to answer questions. And if it's not a good fit for you, then we part as friends. Yeah, there you go. Thank you very much, Lisa, for joining me. I appreciate your input. I appreciate your uh, you know, you're, you're sharing your story. You're, you've got a powerful story. Thank you very much. And if you're looking at this again and you see an opportunity for yourself or it just sparks an interest, you just want some more information, pick up the phone, give us a call. Let us know that you're ready to get started. Let us know that, you know what? I saw something there. I think I would love to do this and we'll see if we can help you. Until next time, Lisa, thank you very much. We'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.